In today's practice, we will do two postures. The supported bridge pose, also known as Setu Ban Sarvangasan and the wind relieving pose or Pavan Muktasan. We will use props that can easily be found at your home. You will need three pillows and two blankets or bed sheets. Let's begin with the supported bridge pose. Lie down comfortably on your back. You can use folded blankets or folded bed sheets to provide support to your head and back. Also keep three pillows handy as they will be required later. Bend your knees, making sure that the soles of your feet are flat on the mat. Now, extend your arms on the floor and move your fingers towards your heels. Try to touch the back of the heels with your fingers. If you are unable to, do not worry. Ensure that your feet remain parallel to each other throughout this sequence. Now, gradually push down your feet into the mat and allow your hips to rise above the floor. With one hand, Grab one pillow and slide it under your pelvis and lower back. Let your arms rest comfortably on the sides of your body. If you feel comfortable enough, repeat this motion and try to place another pillow under your body. After a few minutes, the pillows might start to settle down a bit. You can then try to place a third pillow as well. Keep in mind that each successive pillow will increase the strain on your neck and back. So proceed slowly and cautiously. As you raise your body up, supported by the pillows, you should feel a slight stretch in the front part of the thighs and the abdomen. If you feel pain in the back or neck at any time, immediately remove the pillow and relax by lying flat on the mat. If not, Try to hold this position for three to five minutes. Also, you should try to tuck your chin into your chest so as to maintain balance. Hold this position for a few minutes and keep on inhaling and exhaling. Notice what is happening to the body. Keep your eyes closed and keep feeling the stretch. Apart from relieving back pain, Practicing this posture promotes relaxation and improves digestion. It also helps relieve the hunch in back that stems from sitting in a poor posture. It opens the chest and helps improve breathing as well. This posture should be avoided if you have disc-related problems in your neck and back or knee issues. It should also be avoided during menstruation and if you have high blood pressure. To come out of this posture, press down your feet into the floor again and lift your hips up even further. Slide the pillows out from under your body and gently lower your back to the floor. Next, we move to the wind-relieving posture. It helps release digestive gases from the intestines and stomach and strengthens the back and reproductive system. To get into position, lie flat on your back on the mat. Ensure that your feet are together, both knees and both toes are touching each other. Keep your arms besides your body. Feel relaxed in this position. Take a deep breath, bend both knees and bring them slowly towards the chest. And as you start exhaling, clasp your hands around your shins, interlock your fingers and hug your knees. Now, gradually start to bring the knees towards your chest. Try to press the top of your thighs on your abdomen 
Each time you exhale, try to tighten the grip of the hands on your knees, thereby increasing the pressure on your chest. And each time you inhale, ensure that you relax the grip slightly. Hold this pose for two to three minutes. Continue to breathe normally. Inhale and loosen. Exhale and tighten. Notice what is happening to the body. Keep your eyes closed and keep feeling the stretch. While holding this posture, keep your knees pulled close to the chest, shoulders touching the floor and head and neck relaxed. Although your hips will lift up above the floor slightly, try to keep your lower back on the floor. This posture should be avoided if you have neck trouble, had an abdominal surgery recently, and if you suffer from hernia or piles. Pregnant women should also avoid this posture. Once done, gently release the grip around your knees. Move your legs down to the floor, shake them gently, and relax. Hope you enjoyed this practice. Thank you.